Earlier today, WWE 2K released the Global Superstars DLC pack for WWE 2K24. Now, as you guys all know, a couple of the superstars in that DLC pack was in the WWE back in the 2000s as well as in the 2010s. So in today's video, I will be showcasing to you guys a couple of amazing creations that will be revolving around this DLC pack as well as some hidden content in updated arenas that you guys should go download. But like always, before we dive right into today's video, make sure you guys go ahead and hit that like button for me. Also subscribe to the channel as well because it does help out the channel a lot. But like I always say, let me quit wasting you guys time. Let's go ahead and dive right in today's video so kicking things off first is this amazing upload that is coming from what's the status which is one cena so as you guys can see right here this is a in-game edit model and it is to basically replicate the persona card of one cena that will be coming to my faction very soon which is going to be in the mass mayhem pack now i know majority of you guys will not be playing my faction to even try to pull the one cena card so just go ahead and use the hashtag cena all one or what's the status so you can download it. Now this was a collaboration with Hampton 197 and this one Cena does come with a custom portrait which is his render as well as hidden commentary for one Cena. The ring announcer name being one, one Cena persona attire recreated as you guys can see right here. He also have a DH face under that mask and also new face texture and it can be set as an alternate attire to John Cena. So once again, Go ahead and use the hashtag Cena R1 or what's the status so you can get this replicated one Cena, which will be a persona card and coming to my faction very soon. Now, continuing to stick with what's the status, he also uploaded this amazing Layla, as you guys can see right here. Now, looking at this Layla face, it looks realistic. Now, I was like, you know what? Let me see, can I find some Layla's? I was just going through it throughout the whole day. And once this got uploaded, I said, you know what? I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna download this Layla because this Layla looks very realistic. Now, if you want this Layla, all you have to do is use the hashtag Layla WTS or what's the status? Now, this also was a collaboration with L2K Games as well as 2K Atari Creator as well as Bishop Realist. I hope I'm saying that person name correctly. If I'm not, my bad now this layla does come with a custom portrait which is an accurate render as well as two attires now keep in mind you do need the global superstars pack in order to download this fantastic layla so if you don't got the global superstars pack you will most likely not well not most likely like you will not even be able to download this fantastic layla so make sure you go ahead and get the global superstars pack in order for you to download this amazing layla now sticking with layla and the global superstars dlc pack if you guys didn't know 2k also added in the lay cool tag team motion yes it is in the game but it is titled way cool so if you want to create that great tag team between layla and michelle mccool go ahead and use the tag motion like i said which is titled way cool and you know throw michelle mccool like all of her things on her such as the theme song the time tron the movie trons all of her things on her you know to get an accurate tag team motion for these two and you know save it as well and as you guys can see right here it looks amazing so i'm glad that 2k actually added this in the game for people that you know want to make that tag team once again but like i said go ahead and use status layla because that is the one that looks realistic by far now since we are already talking about tag teams that were great back in the day we might as well stay on that subject because as you guys can see on the screen right here we have another one in this carlito that is coming from what's the status so this is a in-game edit of carlito that is in the global superstars pack now, if you want this Carlito, which is his 2008 and 2009 version, all you have to do is use the hashtag Carlito WTS pack or what's the status. Now, this Carlito looked great, but, you know, it could have been better on the hair, but we got to stick with this because this is what 2K got us working with. But anyways, this was a collaboration with Mr. Fiend X as well as Chameleon 2K. Now, this retro Carlito does come with a custom portrait to match back up in his time, as well as commentary, which is Carlito. The ring announcer name is Carlito. He have a DH face, as you guys can see, a new face texture, and he also have his 2008 and 2009 attires. 
Now, we also got another Carlito that is coming from What's the Status as well, which is from 2010. So this is Carlito 2010 attire. And if you guys didn't know, Carlito was in a tag team around that time, back in 2009, 2010. And you know, his partner was Primo. And since we're already talking about Primo, your boy Blix Action actually uploaded Primo. So as you guys can see right here, this is primo now i think this is a great looking primo to me i didn't find any other primos on the community creation so i did decide to make one and you know upload it since we are in the global superstars pack era right now so if you want this primo all you have to do is use the hashtag blix action and it will be yours so as you guys can see right here this primo does have you know the attire from 2010 to match carlito attire as well and i believe you know i kind of did use the same attire that you know carlito had that was the status upload so huge shout out to them whoever made that attire but i did also make him some other attires as you guys can see right here this is when he was with um epico when they was a tag team and we also have one when he was on his single run and i kind of got this you know from 2011 smackdown versus raw so this was kind of inspired by that but yeah man this is primo and if you do want them to go great with that carlito all you have to do is use the hashtag blix action and this primo will be yours you also have an accurate move set as well now we're gonna stick with these two as well because if you want to create that tag team between these two go ahead and use all of this right here so as you guys can see use generic one for the tag team motion because that is the one that i found to be the closest to the one that they had back from the smackdown versus raw 2010 game and you know also use everything carlito when it comes to the music and the tron so make sure you do all of that and that is the accurate the well the most accurate it's going to get when it comes to creating these two on the tag team in the game and if you want the primo like i said use blix action for the hashtag and if you want that carlito go ahead and use carlito wts pack or what's the status and you should be able to get these two back in the game together once again but moving on from all the retro superstars for right now let's go ahead and talk about current wwe and if you guys didn't know smackdown got a whole makeover and when i say makeover we got like a new era of smackdown right now we got new logos and all of that and as you guys can see right here we have a fantastic updated smackdown arena that is coming from Ketchamania over there on x so huge shout out to him for uploading this smackdown arena now if you want this smackdown arena all you have to do is use the hashtag wealth or catch a mania or sd24 and it will be yours and if you guys didn't know to give you a look you know a quick little secret on it wwe actually approved this arena so you can see right here from their x account they kind of you know approve that this is the one that looks the most accurate so i'm gonna just bring it to you guys and say just go ahead and go give it a download if you want to keep your wwe game or universe mode up to date now switching back over to the 2000s and 2010 era we have this amazing uploaded cane that is coming from apples and oranges over there on x so huge shout out to him and this was also a collaboration with melonic one and the Jumpman 98 so huge shout out to them as well now as you guys can see right here this is the 2010 cane so this cane does come with the call name being cane you also have a custom move set that was made by Melonic One. And you, as you guys can see right here as well, he have his accurate tights. So these are the tights that he wore back in 2010. And this was made by the Jumpman 98. Now the face texture is also spot on. So this makes the cane look even more accurate from when he was back in 2010. And the face texture was made by T. Franklin 2021. You can see he also have a hairline texture that was made by Defrack. Huge shout out to him. These guys been collabing on this cane. And they doing a fantastic job with the collaboration all year. So I'm glad that we got a lot of content creators collabing throughout a lot of creations this year. But as you guys can see, this cane also comes with a body texture and red skin to match the era from back in the day. Like I said, huge shout out to Apples and Oranges for this cane. If you want this cane, all you have to do is use the hashtag Apples and Oranges. And this fantastic retro 2010 cane will be yours now switching back to the global superstars dlc pack there is one more superstar that i do want to showcase that has a retro version of themselves uploaded on the community creation and that is michelle mccu now this is coming from soy aru and you know once again huge shout out to soy aru because they keep the characters updated in the game and as you guys can see he can also make them retro now this is up on the community creations right now and all you have to do is use the hashtag michelle mccu or hashtag smackdown or hashtag soy aru now as you guys can see this michelle mccool comes with an updated hairstyle face texture as well as updated makeup 
Now, it can also be said as an alternate title to Michelle McCool. And keep in mind, you do need DLC in order to get this. And, you know, if you want it, just go ahead and purchase that DLC. I believe it's like, what, $10 in the U.S.? If not, you know, it's $10. I know it's $10. As you guys can see on the screen right here, it's $10. So if you want this Michelle McCool, that Soil El roommate, go ahead and get that DLC. But anyways, guys, it's been Wobblix Action here. Keep you guys posted on a lot of WWE 2K24 news, rumors, leaks, DLCs, as well as updates. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button for me. Also, subscribe to the channel as well because it does help out the channel a lot. And also, let me know in the comment section down below which creation, you know, from this video are you most excited to get? And, you know, are you actually going to enjoy this DLC pack? But anyways, Lex Action, signing off, y'all. Peace.